Normally each week, one player earns the MVP honors for the Denver Broncos based on the game they played. However, this week because of how shameful the Broncos performance was, we get the dud of the week. The winner of this extremely prestigious award goes to none other than quarterback Jeff Driscoll. He got thrust into the game versus Pittsburgh and played admirably, but he was way in over his head versus the Buccaneers. There was a play in the first quarter where the look on Driscoll's face was one of defeat and being lost. Denver tried to get him to bounce back, but he was broken beyond repair for the game and they benched him eventually. While some may focus on the offensive line, Denver called the quicker passing game and Driscoll just held onto the ball. Each sack he took came over 2.5 seconds and the average time to pressure was over 2.25 seconds. The line gave him time to execute the quick passing game, but he just got lost in the lights. Driscoll wouldn't pull the trigger on throws, missed open receivers, and showed he isn't a quarterback in the NFL. His accuracy was atrocious that when he did make a good read, he couldn't hit his receiver. Multiple passes saw his receiver bail him out and make a good play out of something bad. The one thing Driscoll did do well was move the ball with his legs, so at least that's something. Denver needed more from him with his arm, but the game is just too fast for him, and again, he was lost out there. The play Denver got from the quarterback was the play of a defeated player, which was clear with his facial expressions. Now Denver is on a short week, and there is no way they can trust Driscoll as their quarterback going forward. When a player gives up as Driscoll did, that is typically the end of things for them, and his grade of 13.1 makes it clear he gave up. Jeff Driscoll is a good athlete, but he doesn't have much of a future at quarterback with the Broncos, and it wouldn't be shocking if they part ways in the near future. For Malahi Huddle and Sports Illustrated, I'm Eric Trickle.